When I first moved to Canada, I was really weirded out that the kids in my school only ate sandwiches. I always remember like my Caucasian friends boiling hot dogs, and I thought that was the weirdest thing. My lunches consisted of rice, there was a side dish, there was soup. I'm sure a lot of immigrant families don't eat sandwiches, same with mine. So it made me feel a little bit conscious opening up my lunch every lunchtime at school because people would take out their sandwiches and then I'd have like a three course meal. Bringing Indian food to school for lunchtime was considered very uh, disgusting and you know like what is this? Why is it green? Why does it smell like this? I was just this weird brown kid who just brought weird food to school. I was sitting beside my classmates and I opened my lunch and it just smelled like fish and all this stuff. And so if you're not used to that smell, you're gonna be like, <laughs> I stopped eating it because these girls were like, what are those things? It's like fish, like fish in like this anchovy sauce. And they're like, ew, it smells. And I was like, okay, I'm not gonna eat this then. And my mom busted, busted out like some sort of like shrimp pork bun and it, it smelled rancid. And I remember just seeing the look on his face, my friend Jeremy. Like, want, like trying his hardest, bless him, not to vomit like all over our dining room table. So I remember like I'd go over to my friends' houses and we'd be having dinner and they would put up the cutlery and I'd be like, oh, there's no chopsticks. It's kind of uh, interesting when you look at the lunches of the people who are asking these uh, panicky questions and they have Lunchables. I'm not sure what's grosser. That was the last time I had a friend over ever again. I was like, uh, uh, I'm mortified.